Scotia Mayor Jeremy Stutzman has served the community for the last 12 years as an elected official, mayor for the last four. And as his current term comes to a close, he looks towards his hopes for the Goshen community. Being mayor of Goshen comes along with a lot of, a lot of fun opportunities that you get, people you get to meet. I'm really proud of actually is uh, the ability of the elected officials in Goshen, um, this is the majority of us, that we truly work together. Um, I'm, I'm on the Democrat ticket, but um, I just, in my job, I don't worry about Democrat, Republican at all. I don't care who or what other people are. It's all about working together. The elected officials have made progressive work in the Goshen community and have helped lead the city to state honors, such as the 2017 Community of the Year Award. When I think about, you know, the next, next four, eight, 10, 12 years, whatever we're talking about in the city of Goshen, the things that I always want to make sure we're doing, um, doing the most is, is whoever's elected, whoever's, you know, serving in these positions, you know, hopefully they're, they're really looking at the budgets. Um, and it's important to save some money, but you don't want to save it all. You want to, you know, be able to do some good things for your community too. This is an election year here for the city of Goshen. So all elected officials in, in the city of Goshen, that's um, our seven council members. Uh, it's our clerk treasurer, our city court judge, and the mayor of Goshen. We're all up for re-election. And I just, you know, I really encourage everybody. Um, and this, this is something I've said in all of my elections that I've gone through is I just encourage people to get out there and vote. If you're not registered, make sure you are. Um, if you're gonna vote for me, if you're gonna vote against me, I want you to go out and vote because our community, the more a community participates at that level, I think the more it brings us all together. Mayor Stutzman has put his name on the ballot for re-election. The Goshen primaries are May 7th and is shaping up to be an interesting race. For Globe News, I'm Katie Spore.